So one of the good things that came out of the 2020 pandemic is that TV networks across the country now are all doing remote interviews still to this day. And that's awesome because it gives you a ton of opportunities you wouldn't have had if you had to actually go in studio to do that segment, right? In the past, we would have to either focus on local networks or hop our ass on a plane and go across the country to whatever, whatever TV network wanted to interview us. And that can get really expensive and really time consuming. So this is awesome. But there is a facet to this that a lot of people don't think about, and that is securing the area that the camera films. Right, so obviously we're looking at me, I'm in the camera view here, but what's behind me, right? I've got these walls back here, but obviously somebody can't just walk up behind me, but what happens if, if somebody walks into the room, and let's, let's say I had a different setup, and they walk into the camera in the middle of a live interview, right? Now obviously in a Zoom call, or you're having a Teams meeting or something like that, that's not really that big of a deal. You maybe get a little bit embarrassed. That happens on a TV interview, and it absolutely ruins the segment, and you're probably not going to get called back again. So we want to avoid that. And I wanted to give you a great example that I saw on a national news network that really highlights the importance of securing the area that your camera's filming if you're going to be on a remote TV interview. This is so important, and it's something you have to do if you want to make sure that you continue to get TV interviews and that you're able to get interviews that you can then leverage in your marketing to grow your business. And I'm about to show you a video that perfectly demonstrates why you have to take complete control of all of the area that your camera's going to be filming so that you don't botch that interview. All right, let's check it out. Uh, the dogs seem to think that the dog days... Uh... Uh, the dogs seem to think that the dog days... Uh... All right, so hopefully that gave you guys a really clear picture as to why we have to secure the area here and make sure that nobody can walk into the area that our camera is going to be filming. All right, you guys want to get out there and get featured in the media. You want to get called back. You want to keep being on TV. These are the kind of details you have to pay attention to. So if you found that useful, I'd love it if you could share this with the people in your circle so that they can get value out of it as well. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Thanks, everyone.